Hi YouTube, so this video is going to be about how to make your own jewelry organizer. I found this idea on Pinterest and I really liked it so I attempted to do it myself. So all of these little three drawers are actually silverware drawers I got at TJ Maxx for about six dollars. They're just bamboo um, and I painted the insides white. Um, you'll see on some of them like I kept the edges natural and this one got the whole thing painted white. I couldn't really decide what I wanted to do and so I really like the one that's all natural because it kind of gives it a bit of like a divider you can see. But if I did this again I'd probably just tape these outside edges and paint the whole thing white. Um, my spray can was running out of paint so that's why it looks thin in spots. But anyway, um, so all I did was after I painted them I let them dry overnight and these brass looking things are actually picture hangers that you nail into the wall. I think I have one of the boxes right here. I got this at Lowe's. I don't know why my camera won't focus, but yeah, I got that at Lowe's. Um, they were like 99 cents each. There it goes for $8 a piece. And all I did was I took a pair of pliers and the part where you um, nail it into the wall, I bent it out straight. And then once I got it straight, zoom in a little bit here, I just hot glued it to the top and did like a little pin mark to the middle and just kind of, oh, you can see where the glue kind of dried across. But um, yeah, so I just hot glued it inside and um, was able to, I bought two packs, so I had 16. And so it was able to do all three drawers, plus I was able to add four on the bottom of this drawer, and that would hang my long necklaces. Um, so right now I don't have them really organized, I just kind of put them in here. This is kind of like my really nice necklaces, and these are more like costume jewelry. Um, in this one, and the very top, I actually took the nails that came with these brackets, and I cut them in half and hot glued the studs into the top to hang my earrings that are really long. Um, and I also took this, um, this is what I've been keeping my jewelry in. It's all taped up because I was moving and I just didn't pull the tape off. And I actually took the inside here, this is where the necklaces were hanging, and I actually unscrewed and took all the hooks out and I hot glued them on the sides right here, you can kind of see them. And I hung up my bracelets on there, and I on this one I've got my like really huge hoops and things, or these really super long earrings that I never wear. Um, and so once I hung up on my really long earrings, I had two empty spaces. So for this one, I'm going to re-glue one of the hooks here and hang these earrings. They're just like little plastic hoops. And I've got some hoops and some sparrows hanging there and a couple of rings. And in this one... I've got like just those jelly bands that people wear, some extra earrings that I've lost the mate to, more earrings that I'm going to figure out something to do with when I move. Um, it's not, ideally it's going to be attached to the wall, and you'll probably see this in one of my later videos. Um, I'll do like a little closet tour and it'll be in there. Um, but yeah, that's, I just put everything in there just to give myself an idea of what it's going to look like. And to see if I needed to go buy another jewelry or another silverware drawer to accommodate all my jewelry. But actually, I've got everything in these three drawers except one pearl necklace. And that I'm not sure I'm going to put out like the rest of these. Just because I don't really wear it that often and I'd like to keep it nice in its box. So yeah, um, again, I found this idea on Pinterest. It's not something I came up with on my own. I just kind of took the idea and ran with it and kind of made it my own. Um, I definitely recommend using hot glue because these um, silverware drawers are not very sturdy. I mean, they're bamboo. They're very thin. When you get them, you can hear the inner pieces like rattle. So, yeah. Um, if you have any questions about it, just leave a comment and I will do my best to get right back to you. See you soon.